Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. In this video, I'll be showing you how to get the Anime Dimensions badge in the official Roblox The Hunt event in Anime Dimensions. So to get this, you have to play two whole dimensions, which you can just retry the same one. So go over to this and press create. And once you press create, it'll let you choose which one you want to do. Choose the same one I do because it's really easy. Together, the like an amount of time this took me around a little over 10 minutes, but it's not that bad, it's like 12 minutes. Um, and it wasn't really hard to be honest. So basically, once you're in a game, what you want to do is you want to fight these guys over here. Basically, they're titans. It's based off a show. I'm not sure what it's called, but I'm not. I've never watched any other anime besides Pokemon, so don't <laughs> don't even. I don't know my animes, so sorry to the people who watch it. But anyways, if someone wants to put the name down in the comments, that'd be pretty cool. Maybe I'll find it out. But uh, basically, what you want to do is just complete the round. It's pretty straightforward, and it gets really easy as you go on. Since I was level one, obviously, it took me a lot more time. But once I ended off on seven, well, on level seventeen, no, not seventeen, fifteen. Why am I kind of fumbling here, guys? Fifteen uh, ended up doing the other one in four minutes. So you you should be fine, to be honest. This one took me about like seven to eight minutes and the other one took four so i should be fine anyways um we basically want to defeat this big titan over here um this one's one of the more annoying ones but it's not the hardest one to do um there's still another set of ones that come after this so yeah not the most fun thing but it's not a bad game i think it's pretty well made so i'm not sure which one i'm doing next because this is our 83rd one we have about 17 more badges and about 12 more until the egg so we're getting there hopefully i can get those 12 out we can get the fabergé today but yeah we're trying to speed run this i guess a little bit more since it's been about a week since i've started making videos and i think i've made almost 100 videos on the hunt yeah also item videos count too so it's about to be my 100th video almost so yeah but basically we're gonna keep doing this real quick uh we have to fight it until it um dies and when it dies we'll have one round done as you can see we finished with a b not the best, but it, I've never played this game before, so it is what it is. I made it, I played once for like a UGC video, but that was literally it. But yeah, okay, so then this is round two. See how much easier I'm going? It's like a lot more faster this time around. It's not that bad. It's the same thing with like Dungeon Quest. The same thing happened where it took me a while for the first one, and then for the second one, it was kind of easy. But yeah, this, this part is like the most annoying, I think. I don't even think the boss was this bad. I think that just having like 20 of these spawn around you is kind of annoying, to be honest. And then have like two big ones, one in the front, one in the back is kind of eh. But I mean, it's not as bad. And it's for the badge, it's not that bad, to be honest. I mean, I would rather spend this than do like one that takes like 30 minutes. So yeah, but we're almost done here. We're about to finish the boss and we'll be able to claim it. So just put your last few punches against it. Uh, try not to die before then. And I would have gotten S plus if I didn't die that one time, but hey, I still got an S, so we're about to finish. Once you defeat him, you will be able to get the badge once you rejoin the game. You can see I got an S. I would have gotten S plus if I didn't die that one time. I was really trying not to, but it is what it is. And that's still a pretty good grade for my second time around. So let's go ahead and leave. And once we leave, it'll take a few seconds, but we will be teleported back to the main game. Now that we're back in the main game, what you want to do is you want to go over here and complete the two dimensions badge click basically get reward and you will get the badge right at the bottom of your screen you can see it right there and yeah that's pretty much how you get this badge so if this was helpful make sure to leave a like and subscribe and don't forget to turn on post notifications i'll see you guys in the next one